Alright, nothing in here. I think we need to use another stim pack. Ooh, I love how most of the damage we've taken so far has been from us beating our own selves up. Oh god. But hey, we're fucking rocking it up there. We're gonna we're gonna level up in no time. So we got another shaft here that we need to use a rope on. But that's what I just tried to do. I just tried to use a rope on it. There we go. Maybe it had to give me the message that I needed to use a rope before I could use it. <laughs> rat tried to bite me and then crippled itself. You dumb rat. How did that know? How did it know to come after me? Oh my god, Ian, you're crazy. Oh god. Ian might be in trouble. Ian might actually be in trouble here. Remember, he's wounded. He's... He's wounded. Maybe maybe they'll get some critical misses. Oh god. Oh my god, they critically hit him and knocked him unconscious. Holy fuck. Alright, that's one dead. Alright, that's two dead. I'll stand in between you two, Ian. Oh my god, the greater more critically missed and lost her next turn. Yes. Get, get the fuck out of here. Oh my god, he's still alive. What, what about you? I need to get closer. I can't. Okay, good. It's wounded enough, it's running the fuck away. We gotta save Ian. No, I critically missed and lost my turn, but so did she. Get fucked. Oh, ho, ho. Just cut him off with the pass. Oh shit, Ian's- Ian, you fucking idiot! Okay. We're gonna go down and, uh, final- final floor of Vault 15, round two. First, we need to use a rope on it. A uh, duh. Yeah, I know I can't be sent with a rope, that's why I'm using a fucking rope on a dingus. Okay. They haven't seen us so far. Oh god, they've seen us! So. <laughs> Hopefully this time won't end with Ian just getting immediately murdered. Not a great start, though. Not a great start, I have to say. I'm here to smash! Fucking nailed it, dude! Drop anything? No, you don't. He's wounded, but he's doing all right. He has the confident, relaxed stance of an experienced fighter. Oh, you know this to be the meeting room for the vault, where the emergency supply cabinet would be is buried under tons of rock. Oh no. In fact, it looks like there's some bullets here. Here we go, I remember this. We get some explosives here. These are actually very useful. Worth a lot of money and <gasps> what's this? An incredibly, incredibly strong early game gun? Now, I, I like to play the game a little risky. I don't know if you noticed by the fact that I'm playing with Jinxed on. But what if we, what if we mix it up a, a bit? What if we make the game a little harder? And if anyone who's played Fallout before is going to know what I'm doing is absolute madness. Hey, Ian. Why don't you hold this gun? I think you could use it pretty well. Now, see, Ian has an issue. And I'm wondering, maybe let's. this will be a test to see if the, the patch is making him better. Or if we're just incredibly lucky. Ian has kind of a history of... Not being a character you want to give the tell- You don't really want to give any of your companions automatic guns, but especially Ian. Because he, he has a habit of immediately just opening fire on automatic mode on you 
when you're like right next to a rat and blowing your fucking brains out. What the fuck was that? The game didn't know what to do. Alright, Ian, blow my brains out. Ow! Why? You weren't supposed to actually do it. With my fucking face. Oh. A large amount of rubble blocking this corridor looks impressive. You don't think that it could be moved, even with high-yield explosives. It seems that the command and control center is buried under even more rock. You'll have to look for the water chip elsewhere. You earn 500 experience points. That's right. It looks like we ain't getting our water chip here, boys. The game is like... I'm like breaking the game by like initiating combat at the same time these enemies are trying to fight me. The rest of the vault in this direction had delicate equipment that has probably been ruined and destroyed. There is a very low chance that anything of value remains. Oh! Drop my weapon. That's why we carry two. Me. Eh. I don't want to move because if an enemy dies on top of it, it's so fucking annoying to get it back. Oh my god! What the fuck? Did you see how much damage you just dealt? To both of them without hitting me? This patch definitely must make companions stronger. There's no way. There's no way, dude. This is the library. You've seen all the equipment before in your vault library. There looks to be little value left in the room. Alright, let's get out of here. Alright, let's head back to Shady Sands real quick. It'll give us some time to heal. How's it going, Seth? Oh. Thank Dharma, you're here, Wonder. My girl, uh, Tandy, Aradesh's daughter, has been kidnapped. We believe the raiders have her. What? Where are these raiders? They're to the southeast. Please, hurry. I don't know what they'll do to her. Okay, I'll get her back for you. Gotcha. Well, let's go talk to Aradesh about this, my god. Oh, hi. Oh my god, Tandy isn't here. Thank goodness you came. I am in desperate need of assistance. My daughter Tandy is missing. I do not know what to do. Have you tried to save her? My people are not skilled in this. Already three patrols have gone out to look, but none returned. Will you help me? Okay, who could have taken her? Seth and I believe one of the raider clans is responsible. Retribution for our resistance to them. Take this spear. It was found where my daughter was last seen. Hmm. Okay, I'll check it out. Please, talk to Seth. He knows much about these raiders. And Godspeed, Wanderer. <laughs> What's the little sidelines? Got a little spear, okay. Ooh, the spear's actually pretty good damage. I forgot about that. Also, we can throw it, which is pretty sick. Listen, we'll save Tandy in a bit. Did you not remember that we have scorpion tails to get rid of? <laughs> wow, that's fucked up. I need more supplies before I can tackle those guys. Oh, please hurry. I will, I will. Just give me a second, dude. Let's see here. Alright, we're good on health. Oh, we only need to wait an hour? Okay. Let's do that. Let's get these scorpion tails taken care of real quick, and then we'll go take care of it. Looking for Tandy. Can you help? Hmm, Tandy's gone? I find this hard to believe. But maybe she ran away with Seth. I know that they have been eyeing each other lately. Aerodash was always a little bit of a prude. Perhaps it was too much for her, finally. 
I don't think so. I think that she was kidnapped. How awful. If that is the case, I hope she's not hurt. Who's looking for her? Almost everyone. I hope she's found before it's too late. Doctor, before I go, do you have anything I could... There we go. There we go. Well, I guess we're going to the Raiders after all. We've got Tandy. Oh, Raiders, we have some talking to do. Let's move a little bit just to make it daytime. There we go. Much better. So I want to see if we can actually do some trading here. Looking for a woman named Tandy. Seen her? Nah, I ain't seen her. Why are you asking? There's a bounty on her head. If I can kill her, I can get some good cash. Really? What does she look like? About six feet tall. Blonde. She's from Shady Sands. Yeah, she's here. She's in the big house. You know, if we tell Garl, then he'd want a piece of the bounty. You don't want to think about that. So there's a lot of dudes here with names, actually. And some of them actually have some good inventory. Greetings, I am Petrox. I'm one of Garl's lead raiders. Who are you? I'm Clobar. What do you do as a raider? It's a raider. I get to travel to many parts of the wasteland in my travels. I get supplies for the camp. Alright, I don't really want to make these guys mad at me yet, because, I mean, there's a lot of them. They, they got a lot of guns. Hey, that that's uh, that's really great of you. I'm sure that Garl is pleased with you. You know what? What places have you been to? I've been to many places in the wasteland. The closest places that I've been to are Shady Sands and Junktown. Not much happens in those places, but they're always full of information and supplies. Tell me about Junktown. Junktown is a little bit south of here. They have many good women. Oh no. Oh no. Alright, uh... That's really great of you. Okay, yeah, let's end the conversation with him. Okay, we want to talk to this lady. See a desiderator with a pleasant smile and an odd assortment of tools. I am Diana. How might I help you today? How about a date? What do you do here? I'm the armorer for this encampment. I'm the only one with the necessary skills to repair and maintain the weapons and equipment of Garl's men. What can you tell me about the camp? It's run by Garl Deathhand. He is a fearsome and remorseless leader. He makes sure that we all survive the harsh reality of the desert. I'm looking for a woman named Tandy. Have you seen her? She's one of those women from Shady Sands. Maybe you should look there. I just work here. Okay, well, thank you anyway. Oh, no, I still wanted to... Is in a physical store, but we can barter with her. Okay, I thought she might have some weapons, but no. She's got some extra types of ammo. Oh, this is the same. There's two piles. What? Why? Weird. But you notice they all have either guns or spears. What did we find at the scene of the crime? Fucking spear, dude. Someone claims to have seen Tandy. No, these, these, these two are just people. Oh, actually, wait. We haven't gone to this time. So he does abandon with a butcher's knife. Based on how the others look at him, he must have some position of importance. Hello, I'm Dolia. Looks like you just wanted him from the desert. Who are you? I'm, I'm Clobar. What do you do? Okay, these just say the same things. All right. Ian, get the fuck out of the way. Ian! Thank you. Look how many fucking raiders are here. Well, this dude looks important. What do you want? I've come in peace to negotiate the release of Tandy. Hmm. Well then. What do you offer for a release? Let's see here. Hmm. I represent a threat you don't even understand. Do you really want to risk our wrath? You know what? I bet this guy's pretty stupid. This might actually work. Hmm. 
For some reason, I believe you. You may take the girl, but do not return unless you seek our wrath. What's up, Tandy? Let's get out of here. Well, that was easy. But you know, sometimes speech lets you get to... Th you can actually... It is totally viable. Even at this point, you could kill all these people here. It's really hard, but the shit you get for doing it is really good. Honestly, we might come back for them because they can, you get a lot of money in XP. Also, they're fucking horrible people. If we leave them there, they're gonna they're gonna do some horrible shit. Dude, you earned 500 experience for freeing Tandy. You earned 400 experience for returning Tandy to Shady Sands. Look at her go. Oh, she ran all the way home. Aww. Now, yes. Yes. Oh boy. We're getting there. Oh my god, we're gonna be going crazy. Look at this. Before we got speech at 100 and melee weapons at 100, and we just need to start leveling up repair and science, and we're basically set. You know what? First, we're gonna start dumping a couple points into outdoors, just so we can get around the map a little faster. Well, let's go talk to Tandy. I was afraid that you were gone, and I wasn't gonna get a chance to thank you for rescuing me. Oh, that was great! <laughs> Maybe you should've just immediately run away. Sure. Anyway, if there's anything that I can do for you, you just ask. I beg you and I will. You know, no, not good. Nope, that's it. Thanks. Well, thanks for talking. We don't get many strangers Aww. here, so it's always good to talk to new people. Well, see ya. I always thought it was a little disappointing that they didn't give her some more dialogue there. That's one of my few complaints about this game. I will be forever in your debt for your courage and bravery, Wanderer. Here is your reward. Thanks. Until we meet again, my friend. May the water you find in the desert not shine at you in the dark. Alright, I believe we now have fully done everything in Shady Sands. I don't think there's anything left to do here. And now look at all the stuff we're, we're walking away with. Fucking 598. We got all these weapons. We got some drugs. We got all these extra players for selling. We got bombs, weapons. Dude, we are set. And I think it's about time we head to Junktown.